Hi everyone, it's Michael here, and I'm here today to talk to you guys. I want to present a little analogy for you guys, a little bit of a different way of looking at overcoming challenges. And what I want to talk about is, obviously for someone like me who has a hard time moving around, uh, for those of you who don't know, I do walk with a cane, and for longer distances, I do use an electric wheelchair. So, needless to say, stairs are not exactly my best friend, if we can put it that way. Particularly stairs that have no railing for me to be able to hold on to in order to get up. So, the picture here, this is a building that was often used as a restaurant in there, that is often used for meetings here in my hometown of Montreal. And the first time I went out there, I pull into the parking lot, and I get up and I get out of the car and I'm looking and I'm like, oh my God, how am I going to get up these stairs? And as I'm sitting there thinking, I notice to myself that there's a sign on the door that, and as someone's coming out, I ask them, excuse me, could you please tell me what that sign says? And lo and behold, the sign actually said that the event I was going to was moved to another location. So that solved the problem and Lo and behold, I didn't have to get up the stairs, so went on my merry way. Until the next time I was invited to that uh, particular restaurant, and as I get into the parking lot, I remember, oh yeah, the stairs, and I started thinking to myself, well wait, there's got to be another way to get around this. So I, took, I got in the car and I drove around to the back of the building, and there you go, in the back of the building, there's parking for people with disabilities and a ramp that goes into the elevator that takes you up to the restaurant. So, needless to say, problem solved, didn't have to go upstairs. Now, my reason for telling you this story is not to advertise for that particular restaurant, but rather I'd like to ask you guys the question, what is your stairs? What is keeping you from achieving the goals that you want to achieve. And my next question to you is, do you have to go up those stairs? Or is there a sign that you're missing that's telling you, well, you know what? You don't need to deal with these stairs. Go to another place, go another way. And if you realize that you do need to deal with your stairs, is there another way around it? So what I want you guys to do is think about it. What is your stairs? And is there another way? Is there a way to go behind the building and get where you want to go? That's my question for you guys today. Take care and we'll talk to you soon.